Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel and this is a quick tip for people that might have some problems and just can't identify what could be wrong. There are a lot of things that can make a computer go wrong. Most of the time it's either hardware or software, third-party software, drivers from the manufacturers. There's a lot of different causes of problems. But one thing that you can try and this might fix a problem, it's to issue a command which will actually look at the uh, file system and look particularly at all the protected system files from Windows. It's the system file checker tool that will repair or just make sure that it will replace missing or corrupted files in your operating system. This works with every version of Windows pretty much. And if you have some issues and you know, it doesn't cost anything to try, it won't break anything to do it. All you have to do is try it and see if by any chance it might have fixed some problem. What you need to do is simply go to your search box here you can type CMD. Make sure that you actually choose run as a administrator. Once you will be there, you'll say yes. Here, all you have to do is type SFC space and then you will issue the um, scan now command to it. So all you have to do to use it is to do a SFC forward slash scan now and then press enter. This will take time depending on the computer, the speed of the computer. If you have an SSD, an older magnetic hard drive, but it will verify all the files on your system. And if something is corrupted, doesn't seem right, uh, it will actually go and fetch a copy of a file. Windows has most protected files in a uh, folder that is a compressed folder. And when needed, this command line can actually go and get one of those files and replace it if something's wrong. It, like I said, since it doesn't actually do anything wrong, the, um, the, you should try it if you have problems because it will check and if for some reason a file in your system is corrupted. And it can happen in certain circumstances. For example, if your computer froze and you shut it down with the power button, that is a cause of corruption in files from time to time, especially on magnetic hard drive, older computers that have these good old hard drives. Sometimes the read write head, if it was doing something while you shut down, what's going to happen is it can actually, um, while it goes back to the park level, uh, corrupt some of the clusters. And so by looking at the files here, uh, this will, of course, make sure that everything is fine. And like I said, it could take anywhere from a couple of minutes on some very modern fast systems to an hour, easily an hour or two on a very old system. Also, keep in mind that if for any reason your system files are fragmented a lot, it extends the time that this will be uh, taking. The results of the uh, SFC or the System File Checker tool um, can be various. So depending on what it's going to do, it might say everything is all right. For example, here it says Windows Resource Protection did not find any integrity violations. If it did, it will tell you. It will tell you where and what it did. And it might also return in some cases an error message, but most of the time it will say, well, you know, we fixed some problems. And so you can at that point restart your computer and hopefully if you have some freezes, some problems with uh, Windows, this could actually fix the problems. And like I said, don't hesitate to do it for a very simple reason. 
that it doesn't break anything. So even if there's no problem, at least it doesn't break anything. One ex once again, go to your search CMD for command prompt, click run as administrator, click yes here, and it's SFC space forward slash scan now. I will actually copy and paste this command in the description below so you can just copy and paste in your command prompt window if you want to try it. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching our videos.